It has been nearly a full year since Arizona State last played a baseball game. Of course, many things have changed since last year, including how COVID-19 has impacted the team's preparations for this season. Our own Ethan Ryder is standing by at Phoenix Municipal Stadium. Ethan? Yeah, Gareth. There's going to be Sun Devil Baseball, and there's going to be games in Phoenix Municipal Stadium. And while they're playing and while they're practicing with each other, there's not really any hiding it. Things have been a little different. It's just that quality time that you get to spend with your team collectively that I think is a little bit missing. We're all, we're doing it right now. We're all on Zoom, but I think we would all agree that being on Zoom isn't the same as being in person. Not being in person cuts out a lot of normal activities for the team, but they aren't letting those changes affect them as they all can still focus on what they're there to do. Usually we hang out and do stuff here, watch TV, watch sports, play ping pong, stuff like that, and that all is gone. So we're missing a little bit of that competitiveness inside the locker room, but all in all, like we're here to do a job. We're here to play baseball. We're here to win a lot of games, and that's what we're that's what our primary focus has been. So that hasn't been interrupted at all. While they can focus on winning games, it still doesn't mean players won't struggle through the process. Whether it's a freshman struggling with college ball, a senior struggling with confidence, or anyone in between, the team now has an opportunity for help. And it's an opportunity virtually everyone takes advantage of. Every Wednesday night, we have like a optional uh, uh, mental coach we have, and his name is Scott Pelton. And we kind of get on and just talk about um, just stuff that goes on. I mean, just the, the struggles as a freshman, just learning how to deal with failure, stuff like that. And so um, he's been awesome with, with our guys. He's helped out a lot. Others like Brady Corrigan have looked to activities outside of the program to help during this mentally straining time. I, don't know, I like golfing. Golfing's a good reset for me. Kind of just relax. Takes, you get to escape baseball for a while, do something fun. Um, that's kind of my getaway when I need some time just to, I don't know, whether reset or just enjoy some beautiful 70 and sunny. Uh, so that's kind of my thing. While golf is used as a reset of the mind, the team's record has reset as a new season is right around the corner. While preparations have been a little different, they still are preparing to play baseball, and it starts this weekend as they take on Sacramento State in a three-game weekend series. I'm Ethan Ryder, Cronkite Sports. Back to you, Gareth.